Good afternoon and welcome to highlights of Burnley against Southampton. If Burnley win and other results go their way, they could conceivably be Barclays Premier League champions this afternoon. But a win against Southampton will go will more or less seal the deal for them this afternoon. They are the top scorers with 81 goals, with Manchester United a distant second with 58. So Burnley with Ings and Balotelli up front look to cement that partnership and fire them towards the second part of what they'll hope will be a unique travel. That's the Burnley side. It's unchanged yet again. Consistency is the key for John Stutzy these days. Quant there's plenty of quality there in every department from goalkeeper to attacker. It looks a very formidable side and that's the side that Southampton and Ronald Koeman must face this afternoon. Let's have a look at their lineup. Several good players there. Bomber Burnley player Matt Loughton and Bomber Burnley player Michael Keane return. Also, Pella up front and Brace of Forster, Butland's England rival is there. And Michael Keane, as you see there, former Burnley centre back, makes a return to the club he spent a couple of seasons with. Michael Herbert is the referee this afternoon on a day Burnley will hope that the league title will come sooner rather than later. So referee Oliver and County Durham gets us underway. Ashington in the northeast, to be exact. And away we go. Burnley in the claret and blue. Southampton in the chain shirt of green. And it's Burnley attacking from right to left. Trippier now. Left foot. And not far wide. A Fraser forces far up right. Very good effort from Trippier. Forster was worried. He was diving away to his right. Forster going short this time. Misses Lamb. Next Burnley, of course, Matt Lamb. Lloyd Isgrove. One army. Cross coming in. Butland with a fist away. He's been very good with the fist away, Butland, in recent weeks. Boyan. Neymar is on the right. And well picked out, and he's in a lot of space. Two, two, three in the middle for the cross, and it's towards Ings. Who stabs it wide? In fact, it was Loftus Cheek who stabs it wide. A well, lovely cross, and Loftus Cheek just stabbing it the wrong side of the post. And in the end, it's another goal kick. And it's forced to take. High and long. Over the top there. And Isgrove. Pella right in there. There's a cross. And a goal for Wanyami! Wow, that was not in the script. A goal out of absolutely nothing from Southampton in more or less their first attack. And Wanyami makes it 1-0 to the Saints on an afternoon where they obviously not reading, reading the script at all. 1-0 Southampton with a quarter an hour gone. Well, what about it? This is Neymar. Neymar! Good save by Fraser Forster. Pella's header. Off to his cheek. And has lost it. This is Tadic. And Southampton could be in here. Galloway! Oh! And in the end, Boyan got it out. This is Ings. Ings tries the shot, and it's never going to beat Fraser Forster from that range. Pellas flick. Wanyami, the goal scorer. Advantage played from the referee. Is Grove now. Plenty waiting in the middle for the Saints. There's the cross, and Butland got it half away. But uh, Boyan completing the clearance. Now Ings. 
Rodriguez. Off this cheek. And now Ings. Good football again from Burnley. Good strike with the right foot, but clearing phase of Forster's crossbar. And it will be a goal kick. So Fraser Forster himself goes short. Half an hour gone. Bertrand. And look at the space here for Wanyama. Danger here for Burnley. Pull back. And Butland clears the danger there. Danny Ings. Boyan. Good running by the Spaniard. Boyan's cross. And put wide, I think. Was it Ings in there? Oh, he completely miscued it if it was the case. Here it is again. In fact, he's offside. So it was in the end a free kick to the Saints, the Southampton lads in the green who are winning by a goal to nil. Wanyami, the goal scorer. Danny Inks, Mario Balotelli, Neymar will try, good effort again, Neymar Jr, the Brazilian, Borsa was very, very confident that that had gone wide, uh, absolutely short. But it's been a first half that's uh, ebbed and flowed and done all sorts, really. Been a tight old game. And Tadic has got the one on Trippier. And it's Tadic pulled back. Power! What an opportunity there for Southampton to have made it to. There it is again. There's the shot. And Heaton's crossbar cleared by a whisker. Well, this has not been the first 45 minutes we were expecting to see. Southampton ripping the script up uncontrollably here. We've got themselves a one-goal lead to try and protect as the shot goes wide from Ings. It's half-time anyway. So Wanyami's goal after a quarter of an hour has given Southampton a half-time lead. Burnley have missed chances and Southampton now have made them pay. Half-time, Burnley nil, Southampton won. And uh, well, just before the second half starts, Nathan Redmond comes on to replace Boyan. As uh, he'll go to the right. And Neymar now will go into Boyan's old position in the centre of midfield. So one change for Burnley. None for Southampton as yet. And the second half underway. Southampton uh, goal up through Wanyami. And Isgrove towards Stones. And it's a corner. Stones having to knock it out more or less. So Isgrove with the corner. Driven in there, off his cheek with a header back. Off, that one was there. Now off his cheek. Jay Rodriguez having to carry on because Higgs was initially offside and trying the shot! was very very unlucky the skipper struck it well against his own side and it just skimmed the far post well the stats say that all oh, eight shots to two in Burnley's favour but it's Southampton scoring with one of their two shots that uh, is the difference at this moment in time Pella Subpetition to Seps. Neymar. Neymar with a speculative effort, but over the top it goes. Southampton about to make their first 
substitution of the afternoon as we see a replay of Neymar smashing it over and it's in back to double substitution Sado Mane and James Will Prowse will replace Graziano Pella and the goal scorer Wanyami who gets a standard ovation from the Southampton fans so a goal kick Southampton have made two changes now Burnley just the one Southampton lead here's Tadic Will Prowse back to Tadic Will Prowse again Reed, Mane, the other sub. Subajic cuts that out. Off his cheek, giving away to Keane. Looks like a winning return so far to his old club, and it may well delay the title. Celebrations all for a moment. I thought Mane had just broken the offside trap, and he didn't look far off doing so. And his back four was very quick though, offside. Harrison Reed and taken off and Ariel Lomeo will come on, Romelu. Ruben Loftus cheek. Now Brendan Galloway. Poor ball there. And straight to the former Burnley man, Matt Loughton. And we're halfway through the second half, and Burnley really haven't created too much apart from the Rodriguez chance. Lord Prowse, Mane, good ball, Bertrand, Mane, Trippier cuts that out, and keep, oh a mistake by Bertrand, and Ward Prowse from literally eight yards out, shoots over the bar, and it was an empty goal as well, he should have just controlled that, instead of which it remains 1-0. Loftus cheek, Balotelli, and onside here is Ings. Is this the moment now for Burnley? One one, and what a moment for Danny Ings to strike a goal just seconds before James Ward Prowse had missed an absolute sitter. Fraser Forster had no chance even. No, he was beaten at his near post. And Burnley now are back in the game and possibly now need another goal to win the championship. He's into the 11th of the season. 1 1. And it's game on here at Turf Moor. Loughton. Going to the corners. Looks like Southampton here are looking to settle for a point. They're really... I don't know what Loughton's geography is doing that. Oh, Balotelli, first touch was a little bit heavy. Loughton to Isgrove. And he's run out of pitch too. But Burnley won't want to play it into the corners now. They want to go on and win it. Ten minutes to go. Redmond. Pace to burn this lad. Redmond's cross towards the back post. Oh, Balotelli caught it all wrong. And it goes, believe it or not, for a throw. And what a finish now to a game that has had the lot. Tadic keeps it in. Ings intercepts. So too does Tadic. Three minutes to go. Oh, referee quite rarely plays on. There was a foul. But the referee playing it on. Three minutes of added time. Southampton looking to try and win it themselves. But it could be another attack now for Burnley. Neymar. Ings. Good running. 
Good run in. Good run in. And he's in the post. And the whistle goes for time. But well, what a great game to enjoy. And Burnley could have snatched it at the end. They trail to a goal by Wanyame after 15 minutes. Danny Inks equalised midway through the second half. And Annie Inks right at the end there, as you saw, hit the bar, or hit the angle of post and bar. So a point each, it might be enough to win the league, who knows. We'll find out once the tables are updated. But uh, a great point as well, don't forget for Southampton, who played their part in a tremendous game of football. Final score, Burnley 1, Southampton 1. And so with that draw, it means... Means that Burnley don't win the league, not at this moment in time, so they still have to wait a little while. Let's look at the table uh, first as well, um, because it's best to see. We do have a Champions League semi final, and you'll be able to see full coverage of that uh, with us in the next video. Uh, that's Burnley against Zenit St. Petersburg. The winners, in fact, will play uh, Athletic or Madrid or Marseille in that particular final. This is the table as it stands 11 points in it, there's still four games left, so the 12 points to play for. If Burnley win next, next time I was in their next league game they are for sure champions so let's so let's oh Burnley win the next game the gap may well stay 11 points and maybe just maybe the Clarets can celebrate in the final season of this career mode becoming champions of England again but it's all about Europe now for the next game you'll be able to see the whole match Burnley against Zenit is in, in its entirety on Tuesday night, I hope very much that you'll join us for that, and then, and then on Saturday, Saturday May the 4th at Goodison Park, it may well determine if Burnley do win the league or not, and we'll be, we'll be there to see it happen as well. And of course the second leg to come in St. Petersburg as well, so a very, very we could see Burnley win the league and be in the Champions League final within a week. Who knows? And then the three games in the league to come at Stoke at home, QPR at Loftus Road, and then Norwich on the final day will decide. And all these games, in fact, from now to the end of the season, are going to be shown on, in their entirety because of the way the season's panning out. It's the final, final straight of the season. So it will mean... It will mean they will all be shown in their entirety. So we start with Burnley against Zenit St. Petersburg. I hope to I hope we can see you for that one. Until then, take care. I'll see you soon. Don't forget, if you like the video, please do leave a like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. Uh, it's always good to have um, subscribers. We're nearly at 90 now, so we're almost 10 away from that magical 100 mark. Um, magical 100 mark at the moment. Uh, at the time of filming we might have more by then who knows i do record some of these um a few days a few days of weeks in advance and then obviously when we work and stuff it's hard to edit everything down if you want to follow me on twitter the address is at stutzy 83 i'll be delighted to have you following me on twitter uh, the more people follow me on twitter the better uh, and that's it now we'll see you then on wednesday night uh, tuesday night rather as we take on zenith st petersburg at Turf Moor. Thank you for watching. Ta-ra.